Hi. So for our next website, we're looking at Hostos Community College. Um, so starting off with information for faculty, uh, you'll go to the faculty information tab, and you will see here that they have the guidelines for faculty. Let's say if you have a student in your class who has a disability disability and wishes to verify their accommodations with the office, then please contact a member of the department. As you can see here, they provide a link for the faculty guide to teaching students with disabilities. And also you can find below links to, uh, that are related to the Accessibility Resource Center. For example, you have the brochure here. And uh, it, it shows the requesting services. It shows their hours of operations. If you go below, the services and accommodations that they provide and all the other resources. Uh, next is information on making documents accessible. And if you want to find information on that, you're going to go to IT Accessibility. And you'll see here that they have information for students, faculty, and staff um, that they can find out more in regards to that. Very inclusive. And so for our next one is information on assistive technology. And you're going to go to the assistive technology tab. And it says that the Accessibility Resource Center offers an extensive, extensive selection of the technologies that they have there. And if you see below, they have some of the devices that they provide, such as the Live Scribe as a smart pen, Kurzweil, JAWS, Zoom Text, VoiceOver, and they have iPad loans and whatnot. And they have Quick Look. These are the examples that they have provided for us. And for our next one, information about registering for services. You will head over to the Requesting Services tab, and it provides the information here in regards to if the student is diagnosed with a disability and is interested in registering with the office, they will they are best encouraged to provide medical documentation in order to determine the best and most appropriate accommodations. Um, IEPs are definitely important uh, to take note of, and that um, if they can't provide documentation for a disability. Um, they'll follow up with our staff to schedule an intake and review their options. Uh, for the next one, information about the process for requesting specific services. Um, I've noticed that while they don't really have, um, they don't really say in terms of what you can request in terms of specific services, but what I did notice is that they do have academic adjustments. And it says that the ARC staff works closely with faculty and external resources to provide appropriate and effective academic adjustments to students. And these are below some of the examples that registered students may receive based on their individual needs. You have uh, testing adjustments such as extra time. You have the private accessible computer lab access, live scribe, recording smart pen, laptop use in class, and large print or other alternative text format. So, at the very least, they do discuss what adjustments can be made for students. And um, in terms of how welcoming is the Disability Services Office overall, I would say overall it's good because if you go back to the home page, you know, it starts off with the friendly staff photo. I know most of these people here, so they actually are very, very, very friendly, including this guy here. Uh, we have the welcoming statement, and then as below, you'll see that each website has the Disability Services like Shooting video, and it, and it does provide caption. And uh, on the tabs, they do provide a good use of information that a prospective student, for example, could take note of.